Hey guys, it's NPC Cora back at it again with another video, and today we're playing The Witch's House. This was translated by the same person who translated Eve and Misao and all those other games. I'll link their website in the description below if you want to go play all of those games. I don't actually really know what this game is about, but if you're ready, let's just get into it. What? No dialogue or anything? Is that a cat? You're up and at him, eh? Yes. Humans shouldn't be out here. Too dangerous. The cat is my save point. There are roses. What is that? Can I go in there? Can I... Can I go in there? Oh. Oh. Found something rusty and sharp. Take it. Got a machete. The way is blocked by a startlingly, startlingly huge patch of roses. Roses? The way is blocked by a small patch of roses. Can I use an uh, can I use whatever the machete? What I had a there's a letter in, in my inventory. I don't mind if you go out to play. Just stay away from the forest. Hope to see you soon, Dad. Well, too bad, Dad. A cat. Huh? What is it? Hmm. So the way out is blocked by roses. That's creepy. You gonna go in? Might as well, if you can't leave. Sure, let's go in. This is not ominous at all. This, this is definitely not going to die. The, well, if I take any uh, message from Misao and all those other games, stepping on the blood is not a good idea. Come to my room. Okay. Oh, this is different now. Yo, decided I'd follow you for laughs. Incidentally, where the heck did you come out from? I like the cat, he's funny. The basket has a big teddy bear in it. There's a little bit of room left. Can I take that? I can't take the bear. Bear's in the basket. I wouldn't have guessed. What is this? Witch's diary. Read. Or don't. Is she gonna kill me if I do? I was sick, so no one played with me. My father and my mother didn't love me. Okay. Lovely diary. It says, open when the house returns to normal. I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. A teddy bear rests against the pile of presents. Uh, take it? Got a teddy bear. Can I switch this out? Can I? The limbs make it too big to fit. The limbs make it too big to fit? What do I have to do then? To cut off his limbs? That's creepy. Let's go this way. Oh, I see. Okay. I actually do have to cut off his limbs. There's a pair of scissors on the workbench. Take it. You're chained to the bench. Uh, let's, let's see if I can use the teddy bear. Cut off the bear's limbs. Cut off the teddy bear's limbs. Got a teddy bear torso. It's bloody now. It's almost as if the bear was alive. Okay. Let's go put the bear in the basket. And not die, because not dying sounds wonderful. Stuff the teddy bear torso in the basket. Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. Lovely. Did the bear just move? I swear it just moved. I- oh my god! What the fuck was that? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, okay, so do I have to like go back? God damn. Is there a sprint button? Can I sprint? Oh yeah, I can sprint. It shift. Okay, as soon as as soon as oops. There you go. <laughs> God damn, bro. Is this door? What the fuck? There's teddy bear limbs on the ground. Okay, I got teddy bear limbs. Okay. The door opened. Well, um... Oh, I can push the chairs. Taste poison. No thanks. Oh! Jeez, you freaked me out! Don't come out of nowhere like that. Sorry. What? Hi. There's someone invisible there. Talk to them. Ah, I'm busy. So busy. Lend a hand. Oh, thank you. The invisible person grabs your arm. 
They push your wrist onto the cutting board. A hand is exactly what I needed. Oh great, I died. <laughs> oh my god. Strangely colored soup in a skull shaped bowl. Let's not. I think that's the poison. <laughs> the cook is busy. Lend a hand. Can I give him the teddy bear limbs then? Oh, thank you. I was in need of a hand or two. Let me show my appreciation. Got a silver key. Thank you. I knew you were not a bad person. A book titled Dining of Aristocrats. Oh, sure. People of ruling and wealthy classes have long enjoyed dining with silverware. By using such hard-to-clean cutlery, they could hire servants to demonstrate their wealth. In addition, silver utensils change color upon contact with poison, making them quite useful. Can I actually put this key in there and see if- because it's a silver key. Put key in soup. The key turns black in the soup. Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. Oh, lovely, thank you. Can I actually- can I take the key back? Because I kind of want it. Strangely colored soup in a skull shaped bowl. Okay, I can't take the key back. Mmm, okay. I can't even interact with that. Okay, let's. The door open. Oh, cool. Oh, hey, who's that? Oh, now I'm scared. Nothing of note. There's a butterfly in a, in a web. Butterfly is caught in the web. It's not. I'm deathly afraid of spiders, and I don't want there to be- there's a piece of rope in the barrel. Sure, let's take it. I don't want there to be a spider that's mad at me for taking its butterfly, so no thanks. Oh, the cat! Hi! A decorative cat ornament. Gotcha! I like the cat. He's nice. Lovely. Oh, there's things in here. A book titled The Witch's House 2. The form of the house can be changed by way of the witch's magic. Book titled Witch's House 1. Keys do not open doors of the witch witch's house. Something else must serve as a key. As I've seen. Namely, putting silver in soup. A book titled A Funny Story. Once upon a time, there was a rich man pulling along a cart full of treasure. His cart had broken down in the woods, but there came a passer passing hunter and his dog. The rich man pleaded to the hunter to keep a close eye on his cart, to which the hunter agreed. The rich man went to get a new cart. Meanwhile, the hunter kept watch. Night soon fell and the hunter grew worried for his elderly mother still at home. So the hunter told the dog to watch the cart and went home to check on his father. On his mother, sorry. When the man returned, he saw the dog on guard. So he gave the dog a reward for his master, a silver coin to carry in his mouth. The dog ran all the way home and brought his master the coin, but the hunter flew into a rage. I told you to watch the cart. What did you do? You stole from it. So the hunter killed the dog. Is there someone sitting there? Oh my god, okay. Uh, residence burns down. XX and his wife XX were found dead in the wreckage. Their bodies were found to have stab wounds, so it is suspected they were murdered before the building was set aflame. Additionally, XX's only daughter, daughter Ellen, currently 17, has been missing since the fire. The police... and then it ends. Here. Whoa! Okay. It's locked. Okay, so there's some small text on the door. Save the butterfly. Oh, so I have to do something with the, with the butterfly. What? Oh, it's a butterfly. There's a blue wing butterfly model in the case. I don't think I should take it right now. What the fuck? Picture of a white cat done with wool. Let's go down this way. Bookshelf? Small bookshelf. A book is missing. Oh, I have to put a book in. Maybe that's the way to solve the puzzle? I didn't read this when I was here. The spider has poor eyes. You can't even tell colors apart. So I do have to replace the, the other thing with the with the butterfly. Oh, I didn't notice that. There's a shadow right here. There's someone here. There's someone invisible there. Sorting these books isn't going well. Need something to tie them together. Here, I have rope. Ah, you're giving me this? Yeah, thank you. Take this. Got book of death. Oh, so this is the book that I need to put um in the bookshelf. Whoa. The knight got up and walked away. The cat has nothing to say about that. I think I died. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> I opened the book of death and I died. That's Obviously how it works. Obviously you don't open the book of death. What wrong with you? What a complacent little child. Heard the lid of a glass case coming What's out. What's her name? 
Are you okay? Did you hear something? <laughs> what the fuck is that? Is that just a skull? For all of the viewers out there, I want you to know that I can't hear anything, so I don't get jump scared by it. I've seen a guy running around a corner, and Cora here just jumps in her seat. You do it. Why would I do that? Because you were you you finished that chase scene in Misao that I couldn't get. Is past. there a sprint? Button? Yeah, it's shift. Okay, shift. <laughs> do not give me your headphones. Why? I do not want them. Which way are we going? Are we going up to the left? Yeah. Okay. Like, we're trying to leave. We're also trying to get the butterfly out of the case, so, like, I think you have to run around the bookshelf. Why does it keep on stopping? Because you're supposed to get chased. Oh. It stops. It it's shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll get it. No worries. Stop. Close. I can't remember. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I am a pro with these games. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, now that we've got the butterfly, we can replace the butterfly. Awesome, let's leave now. Because I don't like spiders. Thanks, that, that's so appreciative. Butterfly flutters out of your hands and slips out through the wall. Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. Okay. The library door is slightly ajar. I am not going in there though because I don't want to. It's creepy. What the fuck? What is this? Oh, cat. Yo! The wall is red stained and sticky. Well, that's creepy. Ah! What the fuck? Uh, okay. Excuse me? Oh, I have to outrun the other ones. That makes sense. Okay. I got it, I got it, I got it. There you go. The cat is here. Yay. Good. Okay. By the way, this is a witch's house. You knew that, right? Right. A frog! Not. The frog came along. <laughs> Yay, I got a frog. Do you like frogs? I do like frogs. Very thin bridge. Uh, look across. You can see some sort of lever. Inspect it. It's thinner than your leg. It's snapping any second under your weight. Okay, okay. Let's, can I tell my frog to cross it? Send the frog across. Yay! Frog friend. Just don't die, please. Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. Yay! I have a frog friend! Who the fuck was that? Do I have to put things where they're supposed to be? Like, are, do, I, do they have to be exact? Or sit down. I'll come back for you, I promise. Take, take the rose. Place the rose. Okay, there you go. There's a piece of cake. Oh, okay. There you go. Put the cake on the table. Tear it off. Tore the note off. The left and right rooms are mirrored. Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. Frog friend? Yay! I get to keep my friend. Which is diary. My father and mother didn't love me, so I killed them. I've been in this house ever since. Damn, she killed them. Through the next door and let nothing distract you. What? Excuse me? <laughs> Are you kidding? Oh my god. Dude. Okay, so wait. Through the next door and let nothing distract you. Does that mean I can't turn around? Do I have to rearrange this whole room again? I do. I'll be back. Okay, through the next door and let nothing distract you. So... I think to dodge the knife, I turned, like, right, so should I just, like, walk through? Ah, I see. I assume literally everything. 
He's hungry. Fuck. <laughs> Who? Something's on the other side. What? Look at the door. There's a viewing window the size of your palm. Listen closely. You hear something big crawling. Do nothing. He's hungry? I, I assume I can't go because I'll die. Oh, wait. No! Not my frog, friend! He's incredibly frightened. No! Frog is reluctant. Force the frog through the hole. I'm sorry! I'm so sorry. My frog! I'm so sorry, dude. You see nothing. Can I go in then? Really? Never mind. Wait, listen. You hear nothing. Let's let's try it. Let's go in. There's nothing here. My frog! No! Why? Why did I have to sacrifice my frog? Cat. A cat statue. Kidding. My frog! My frog! <laughs> Man, okay. That's all the time I have for this episode. I can't believe I just sacrificed to my frog. I didn't even see what was inside, but I had to give up my frog anyway. <laughs> Oh man, okay. Well, I, I like this game. It's really cool. The jump scares are really creative, as so are the puzzles. If, you like, if you'd like to see more, remember to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!